you want to be able to withdraw $35,000 a year from your account each year for 15 years after you retire. You expect to retire in 25 years. If your account earns 5% interest, how much will you need to deposit each year until retirement to achieve your retirement goals? The first step is to determine the present value of an account which allows you to withdraw $35,000 a year for 15 years that pays 5% interest. Let's begin by entering the required information for the TVM solver below. Capital N is going to be the number of compounds or number of withdrawals per year times the number of years. Because you want to withdraw $35,000 once a year for 15 years, capital N is one times 15 or 15. The interest rate is 5%. We are solving for the present value, so we'll come back to this. The payments you want to receive are $35,000 a year, and therefore the payment is $35,000 because you are receiving that money. The future value is the value of the account after 15 years, which would be $0. And because you're withdrawing $35,000 once a year, payments per year and compounds per year will be one. And now we go to the calculator and determine the present value. We press apps, enter, and enter, and now we enter the information. We have 15 for capital N, five for I percent. We'll come back to the present value, enter. The payment is positive 35,000. Enter, future value zero, and payments per year and compounds per year will be one. Again, this is because you're collecting the money once a year, and therefore we're also assuming the interest is compounded yearly, because it doesn't tell us otherwise. And now we go back up to the present value and solve for present value by pressing alpha enter. And notice how this is negative because this means you would have to pay this much money today in order to collect $35,000 a year for 15 years in the future. So the present value is negative $363,288.03. And now because you expect to retire in 25 years, you have 25 years to save up $363,288.03 to reach your financial goal. So this present value, which is negative, becomes a positive future value for a 25 year annuity, and therefore the future value is 363,288.03. And because you'll make deposits once a year for 25 years, capital N is one times 25 or 25. The interest rate is still 5%. The present value or starting value of the account is zero, where you're solving for the PMT amount, which is how much you must deposit each year, and the payments and compounds per year remain one. So now going back to the calculator, we update the information. Going back up to the top, N is now 25, enter. The percent is still five. Present value is now zero, enter. We are solving for the payment, so we'll come back to this. The future value is 363,288.03, enter. And the rest of the information stays the same. We go back up to the payment, and now we solve for payment by pressing alpha, enter. Notice how it's negative. This is because you have to deposit $7,611.78 each year for the 25 years to reach your financial goal for retirement. So the payment again is negative $7,611.78. So as a complete sentence, so as a complete sentence, you must deposit $7,611.78 each year for 25 years to reach your financial goal for retirement. I hope you found this helpful.